normal distribution, finding the middle. You're looking for a new apartment and have discovered the average size of the apartment in a city is 350 meters, with a standard deviation of 27 meters. Given your budget, you want to find the middle 60%, the maximum and minimum of the average size of the apartments in the city. Assume the variable is normally distributed. Now, what we need to do is we need to use Megastat. So let's go to Add-ins, Megastat, Probability, and Normal Distribution. I'm just going to bring this over a little bit. And always remember, first thing we do is clear. Now, first thing I want to do is I want to click on my Show Center Line. And for my X label, or my Axis labels, I want to show X. Next, I want to type in my information. So I know my mean, my average, is 350. So let's just type that in, 350, with a standard deviation of 27. So standard deviation equals 27. Now, this time, I don't want to calculate the probability given X. I don't know X. I want to find X. So what I need to do is calculate X given the probability. Okay, so I want to calculate my maximum and minimum, my X, given probability of middle 60%. So I click on calculate X given P. Now, when I, when I click on calculate X given P, if you notice here, I have my probability P, and I have to type in what is my probability. Now, before I type this in, let me just show you what we have to do here. I'm looking for my middle 60%. So what I need to do is I have to take my 60% and put it into decimal form. So 60% in decimal form equals 0 0.60. Next, what I have to do is I want to find the maximum and minimum. Okay, I want the high and the low, the upper and the lower limits. So what I need to do is take 60% or 0 0.6 in decimal form and minus it from 1.0 okay? and when I do that okay, I get this answer 0 0.4 okay? so what I want is I need to put in this 0 0.4 here into my probabilities so 0.04 and what I'm looking for is I'm looking for maximum and minimum so when I'm looking for two things maximum and minimum I'm actually looking for a two tail Okay, I'm looking for the upper limit and the lower limit. Okay, I'll explain this more once we draw the graph out. Okay, so I'm going to click on OK. And let's just zoom in here a little bit. Okay. And what I've done is this. Okay, my maximum limit, okay, given an average of 350 and a standard deviation of 27, okay, the maximum limit of 60%, okay, the middle 30%, 30% here, the maximum I can afford, or maximum I'll be looking for, is about 372.7 meters. And the minimum apartment size will be about 327.3 meters. This area in the middle, this light gray, is the 60%. 30% here, 30% here. The dark gray in the tail here and here represents 20%. 30% okay? plus 20% equals 50%. 50% is below the average. 30% plus 50, 20, uh, 30 plus 20%, 50% is above the average.